you guys so i am back with a brand new video in today's video i'll be showing you guys how i achieved my twist out that i'm rocking right now i did use a diva curl styling cream um it is the touchable curl definer it says define and control i did get this product in my gratis at work so keep that in mind um it do have the product in an actual like bottle but i did have like a sample size in this packet and honestly i didn't think that this entire packet would last for like my entire hair but surprisingly a little bit of this product goes a long way and I didn't even use the entire packet. I do have enough hair for like another twist out but a little bit goes a long way and I honestly love the way that my curls reacted to the product. As soon as I put the product on my hair my curls reverted really quickly which I loved. My hair feels so soft you guys. It's not crunchy. It's really nice and soft and it moves very well as you guys can see. So yeah I do love this product a lot. The definition of my curls look really good. Keep in mind my ends do need to get trimmed so I'm not going to fault the product for that. It did curl the best of it that it can but my ends do need to get trimmed on its own. But yeah this is just pretty much just you know what it looks like and if you guys want to see how I achieved this twist out then of course let's just jump into the video. Alright you guys so my hair is washed, deep conditioned and shampooed. Um, so I will be doing my twist out and I kind of figured I haven't done a twist out in a hot minute on my hair. I remember twist outs used to be like my go-to hairstyle, but lately I have been killing my wash and goes. So I kind of figure I'm doing a twist out. Let me just go ahead and film the video on the camera so you guys can see what my routine looks like. Um, so I do have my products that I typically use in front of me, and I do have one product that's new that I'm actually using to do my twist out with. So um, I do need a detangler because I did detangle my hair in the shower, but... I still kind of feel like I need to have a detangler to help me detangle my hair without doing it in two sections. So I do have the Man Until Detangler. It's the Knots, it's the Tangles and Knots Solution. So I do have this. And then for my leave-in conditioner, I have the Not Your Mother's Royal Honey and Kalari Desert Melon. It's a repair and protective. It's a leave-in conditioner. And I have my scissors for my straggly ends. And then I have my clips right here on my shirt so I can have my hair clipped in sections. I have my wide tooth comb. And then the star of the show is going to be um, my Diva Curl. It's actually a gratis item from work. Um, it's going to be the Diva Curl Styling Cream Touchable Curl Definer. It says define and control and here is the packet. Um, we only got like a packet of it. We didn't get the actual bottle. So keep in mind, just look for the actual styling cream bottle in the store if you guys want to try it out. So I will have to use this very sparingly because I don't have a lot for my entire hair. So um, to get started, I'm just going to go ahead and part my hair in terms of the section. Um, I'm not going to do a middle part. I'm going to do like a side part. So just going to go ahead and part my hair so the same way I have a side part for my wash and go I have a side part for my twist out as well I just prefer it that way I think it looks better versus like straight down the middle all right now I'm going to uh, spray my leave-in conditioner all over my hair Now I'm going to section my hair so I do have one section right here and then for this section I'm going to break it off into two sections. I'm going to take the front and put that up and then in the back you guys already know it's the same thing as my wash as my wash and go. I'm going to take this into another subsection but first I'm going to take my detangler and go ahead and detangle my hair. All right, start with the product. I'm gonna take this much because I don't really have that much product to work with. So I don't wanna use too much product. And I do like to twist my hair tight. I don't like it to be loose because 
eventually when you're done twisting it's going to loosen back up so I just kind of feel like why twist it loose when it's going to twist when it's going to like get loosened back up so I do like to uh, twist it tight All right, so when I get to the front of my hair, I like to take my curls or my twists a little bit smaller because I feel like that pretty much like frames your face. So I like to be a little bit smaller with my twists. You guys, look at how my hair is pretty much reacting good to the styling cream like it's automatically curling up really nicely so I feel like this product for a wash and go would be really nicely because my curls are already reacting to it really nicely All right, you guys, excuse my look. It's actually 5.21 in the morning. I'm actually heading out the door to go to work. Um, but we have to take our twist out, and I did let my twist sit for 24 hours. So hopefully everything looks good because I haven't used that new Diva Curl product before. So, yeah. Um, only two things I have in front of me is just my almond oil and I have my Eco Styler. I know everyone keeps saying Eco Styler is canceled, but listen, I'm going to still keep using Eco Styler because I love the product and I kind of feel like if it was bad for my hair, it would have already broken out by now. So, you know, <laughs> so I'm going to take a little bit of Eco Styler and just put it on my edges in the front. Alright, I'm just going to take a little bit of oil on my hand, just a small amount, rub my hands together and just rub it through my hair. I'll start taking down my twists. Just gonna take this piece and just separate it out slowly. And I'm gonna try my best to not disturb my curls.
just gonna take my pick and just pick at my roots. That's it. <laughs> 